Hi everyone, I'm Jeff Teague in Raleigh, North Carolina. I'm your Toyota resource. Today we're gonna look at America's best and favorite mid-size truck, the Toyota Tacoma. It's reliable, it's tough, it's dependable. But let's look at an upgrade option you can get from the port, your regional assembly port, where you can kinda jazz it up, pimp it out, make it your own. This, my friends, this is 2021 Tacoma TRD Off-Road. Tough, rugged, ready for the trails. Rawr! But now we've got behind it a Barcelona Red truck. It's TRD Off-Road also, and that one has an XP Predator package. XP Predator package is something that Southeast Toyota region adds at the assembly point. And you'll see the wheels and tires and badging all different. XP Predator package is on the Barcelona Red. Look at the wheels and tires. You'll see some differences. And then the cement one here does not have that. So let's walk around the cars. Show and tell day, my friends. Then you'll start to see some differences here. That car just pulled in there. Dang it. I wanted to film that. That's okay. We can still get around it. And then notice that it does not have the tailgate insert. It's cement colored. Now let's walk over here to the Barcelona Red. Where you can see it not only has X-Series badging, it's got the V6 blacked out. Because it's black, all black. And then it's got the black... Tacoma insert. So let's look at the cement one. Which one do you prefer? And then let's look at these wheels and tires. Standard on this one, we've got the 16 inch Goodyear Wrangler tires. They're all terrain adventure tires. Not bad, not bad at all. And then what we're going to do is we're going to pop on over here, take a look at these, going upside down here, 265-70R16. So let's come over here and look at the XP Predator package. It has the Goodyear Wrangler Duratrac tires. These are also 265-70R16, but in place of the two-tone wheels, on the off-road standard, we've got the gloss black TRD alloys with the red trim. Which one do you like better? And then on this one here, we're gonna see the exhaust is different without the XP Predator package. Come on over here. Has the black exhaust tip with the Toyota symbol on it. Toyota representing. Yes, it is. We've got some more badging to look at here. We need stinking badges. See, it's got chrome. Tacoma's all in chrome, right? Well, not anymore, mister. Not only do you pick up black overlays for Tacoma, but you also pick up the XP badging along the side that's not on the other one how about this one which color do you like cement or barcelona red the other thing we've got to look at that's on the xp predator package that's not on the off-road but wait is it we've got these predator pro step bars that you can easily step up on into right well how come they're on this one? Well, because you can get them as a port installed option. This was an individual line item, a la carte item that was put on at the regional assembly point. This is part of the Predator package. What's the deal with that? Hey, here's another look at those Predator Pro step bars. Are those something that you would wanna have on there or would you like to have flat running boards? Here's XP Predator package. If you notice, the suggested retail on that is almost $5,000, so close to $5,000, but it's got a discount, which puts it at $2,900. So take a look, it's got the wheels, the tires, those all-terrain tires, black overlays, tailgate insert, badging, the step bars, and the tip. 
You know, the other thing we could look at too is this is a double cab long bed. It's a six foot bed. That's not standard. So on the window sticker or the consumer spec sheet, it'll say L slash B long bed. All right, that's six foot. Or you can come over here. I don't think I can make that. Or you can get this five foot standard bed. Which one's better for you? Let's look at the window sticker for this long bed here. Cement color. Notice how it says L slash B. That's how you know you've got a long bed on your hands. That'll be about 140 inches long. A traditional regular bed is gonna be about 127 and a little bit more inches in length. So here's the safety ratings. Here's the fuel mileage, 20 combined, 22 highway. This is what I wanted to show you though, standard features and then also the options, because there are a lot of options on this one that you may be interested in when you're making your purchase. Because it's an off-road, it has crawl control, multi-terrain select, locking rear differential. It's got those off-road tuned suspension with Bilstein shocks, nice. Hill start assist. Here's those regular wheels. Okay. See it has fabric trimmed seats. Watch this. This one here has LED headlight upgrade, LED daytime running lights, and black bezel. Bezel. LED fog lights. Don't change the bezel. Turn it up a little. I got a dining room full of fine dime bristles. It also has the premium off-road package. Leather seats with heated front seats, auto headlights and moonroof, JBL speakers, woo! And then the technology package, parking sonar in the front and the back, blind spot monitor with rear cross traffic alert. All right, so we'll take those, get them delivered to the dealerships. Then this particular one, since it didn't have the Predator package on it, is gonna add those in line item. All weather mats, paint protection on the door and the cable charging package. That's going to put this baby right here at 45,555. So what does that mean exactly? We've got the leather seats with an embossed pattern here. See the seats are down or the headrests are down. The seats are also all the way back. It's got a moonroof upgrade. Holla. And then we'll look at these seats too. Remember, they've got leather trimmed seats and also heated seats in the front, not in the back. See, it has leather wrapped steering wheel, all of your steering wheel controls. I don't have the key to this one, so we're going to leave those controls as is. It has an eight inch multimedia screen along with digital dual temperature controls. It's got wireless charging. And then we'll just take a look at what else we got going on here so you can just see for yourself. Off-roading controls, locking rear differential right by the phone button, the SOS button, and then crawl control, multi-terrain select down here so you can get through and out of an obstacle. How do we know it's JBL? Well, we know. All weather mats, we know. And then of course it says J to the B to the L. Yes, sir. The camera angle in relation to the sun is gonna be really tough to find out what exactly is going on here. But if you can see, we've got LED fog lights there. They don't normally do that. That's the camera that's making it seem flashy or stroby. But LED daytime running lights, headlights, and fog lights, baby. Maybe if I come over here, you'll see it better. I don't know. Either way, it looks great. They last a long time, low cost of ownership, and they help you see a little bit better, especially at night. This one here, this is the regular one regular double cab, so it's a five foot bed. Safety ratings, the fuel mileage is gonna be the same. 
okay. We'll look at standard equipment. Stop the camera if you want to learn a little bit more. It's going to be the same as the other one. Let's look at pricing. 37,530, and then we add in the LED light package, premium off-road package, technology package. Whoa. Get it delivered. We're going to add in the XP Pred right here. All-weather mats, cable charging package, and two rear USB ports. Could look at that if you guys want. Puts it at 47.3. And then I will show those rear USB ports. Rear USB in the house, right there. So that might be a great way to stay connected with your family. You can all be connected to the internet. So you're all connected. Symbiotic relationship, maybe. And then the other thing we'll notice, we've got blind spot monitor right here. I'm not watching while I'm walking backward. Probably hit something. And then we've got parking sonar, part of the tech package, right? Rear cross traffic alert is associated with this one right here. And then we'll come over and look at the front one last time everyone thanks so much for watching i really appreciate you all you've helped me get to eighty thousand subscribers thank you guys so much as we head to 90 and 100k i'm excited we're going to keep trying to get better improve the channel make it more polished give you more variety of content it's going to be fun. It's going to be a lot of fun. We got a lot of exciting things coming for 2021. Anyway, thanks everyone so much. Follow me on Instagram at Toyota Jeff one. And then I'm on Facebook at Toyota Jeff and I write for Torque News. I just did a story on 2022 Forerunner and the changes that you can expect on torquenews.com slash Toyota. If you want to learn more about Toyota Jeff or you want to send me an email, have a question for me, toyotajeff.com. Thanks everyone so much. Maybe leave a comment. Let me know what you think of these. <clears throat> let me let, know what you think of that. Blech. Anyway, we've got cement. We've got Barcelona red. Pick your favorite. Do you like a long bed or a regular bed? Do you like any of those packages? The LED, the premium off-road? Do you like the tech package? The Predator package? What do you think of that? Thanks everyone so much. See you next time.